All right. <clears throat> totally excited for today. Been waiting for these for a long time. These are the Cobbler Unions at the Richards in the Museum Cognac, the City Last unboxing. Uh, I've been eagerly awaiting or watching my uh, UPS tracking numbers and they finally came here today. These shoes took a lot of uh, research. I wasn't really into dress shoes. And uh, when I saw these cobbler unions, I knew I just had to have them. Little features that I love on them. I feel like you're getting a really uh, high-end, uh, you know, near bespoke level shoe. It, they say bespoke inspired because there are features on these that don't uh, come on your regular shoes at this price point. This is a cool little box. Take them out. Went with the Richards. I'm a pretty uh, simple guy. I do have a just got another pair of uh, double monks from Magnani, and uh, but I've, man, I've been waiting for these. A, I'll talk about some of the features that I love about them. But this is uh, the Saphir cream with that, <clears throat> and then uh, there should be some. Uh, Yes, there are definitely shoe trees in the shoes, which is awesome. Beautiful uh, little shoe case here. So, is that? Uh, that's nice. That's just the right amount of like burnishing or patina I was hoping for. It's kind of like marbling. I didn't want it to be too drastic. Didn't want it to be too loud. Obviously, I'm going with the cat toe, <clears throat> so I didn't want it to be something too outrageous, but uh, I'm excited to turn these over. One of the reasons I got them is the bevel waist here. I love that. Kind of a fiddleback waist, the beveled waist here. You don't see these on a lot of shoes at this price point. Great combo heel. The closed channel stitching. A lot of shoes have stitching. You can see it right through there. You can slice that up stitch underneath it and cover it back up. Some people call it a blind stitch or an invisible stitch. This right here, that's one of the reasons I went with them. I like that they're from Atlanta, Georgia, and they're made in Spain, but their uh, headquarters is in Atlanta. So that's pretty cool. Looks like some good stitching around here. Goodyear welted, which is, uh, if you don't know what a Goodyear welt is, it's a higher end way to put the sole on the shoes that allows them to be resold. In case you wear through this, you don't have to get rid of all this shoe. You don't want to throw away your shoes after one use. You can pay a little bit, have them resold instead of buying a whole new shoe. Another reason I went with these is they have a quilted heel cut and I'm excited to try these on and see what that feels like. Feels nice. The leather's still pretty uh, substantial, but I'm kind of a bigger guy, so I wouldn't want it to be too soft. I just go right through the quilting. Feels nice. But man, these are super. Ah, the stitching's great. It's calf skin. Doesn't look like there are many any flaws so far. Like they didn't let these shoes leave the building without looking great. But man, I am a sucker for that. It's so nice. Got the little uh, nail holes here. It's so cool. Anyway, I'm assuming the other shoe looks exactly the same. Uh, one, I guess, one uh, scary part when you uh, buy shoes like this online, obviously you save some money not going through a middleman, but you have to worry about whether they'll fit. You don't get to try them on first. But I can ship them back if I have to. I'm just going to say a little prayer that they fit like a glove when I try them on. Got the Cobbler Union shoe trees came with it. Well, it didn't come with it. I ordered it extra. But I am very excited <laughs> to make an outfit just to go with these shoes. I 
and we'll find something that looks nice and shows these off. So, uh, Cobbler Union out of Atlanta, Georgia. Shoes are made in Spain. Goodyear welted. Again, uh, using the full grain calf, calf skin on the shoe. Fantastic uh, burnishing on here. Got that fiddle back or uh, beveled waist right here comes in. And if you can't see that, it kind of sticks up right here. The shank, which gives a little structure, a little firmness in the arch. Makes that rise up a little bit, and I love that. Yep, these are the shoes. These are the Richards from Cobbler Union. Uh, I may do a video comparing them to the Magnani's. They're a double monk, so they're really not the same shoe. And we can check uh, and look at the stitch density or something like that. Just to kind of take a look at them, too. Anyway, that is it. I'm excited to uh, condition these up, make them shine, and start wearing them. Thanks for watching, and uh, look for another video soon.